Hello, everybody, and welcome back. Uh, we're on to question number 11 on the 2001 Grade 7 Gauss Papers. That's the Gauss Paper aimed at Grade 7 level students uh, from the year 2001. And as I say, we're up to question 11. That's the first question in Part B. So it's going to be our first question that's worth six marks. Uh, hopefully, we'll get all six marks. Well, either we do or we don't. Uh, we're not going to leave question blanks, uh, questions blank. We're going to get ourselves a uh, final answer. So let's take a look at question 11. Hopefully you've had a chance to look at it. And you're just viewing this to, to double check that you got the right answer. So question 11, a fair die is constructed by labeling the faces of a wooden cube with the numbers 1, 1, 1, 2, 3, and 3. If the die is rolled once, the probability of rolling an odd number is, OK. So uh, sometimes I encourage people to bring little uh, extra materials to the contests. Uh, they're not prohibited in any way. Uh, you just can't bring like math notes or anything like that. But you could bring a little wooden block or, or something like that. Uh, uh, you can ab absolutely bring your calculator. And uh, I encourage bringing spare sheets of paper. So one of the things that you can bring is a dice. And that can certainly help you conceptualize problems about cubes or about dice rolling, which is a question like this one. Okay. So we have uh, three ones, one, two, and two threes, and we're asked to figure out some probability. Well, because it's a wooden cube, each of these are going to be uh, assumed to be equally likely outcomes. So we could get one three, we could get the other three, and so on. So if we want to figure out probability, The probability of something happening is always equal to uh, the number of outcomes. Uh, so the number of uh, desired outcomes over the number of possible outcomes. So in this instance, we're looking for uh, the number of odd rolls that we could have over the number of possible rolls. Now there are six faces on the die, so there's going to be six possible outcomes. Each of the different faces is different. And a number of odd rolls. Well, we have a, we have a one one, we have another one, we have a second one, and we have two threes. So it's going to be five. So the probability is our desired outcome. How many of those are there? Well, how many odd faces do we have? We have five of them. How many possible rolls could we have? We have six different faces, so five out of six is our answer. That's what we're looking for, a probability of five out of six. And if we check, oh, that's the first one. So our answer should be A. So that's question 11 for us. It's a nice little start to part B, and uh, we'll continue on with question number 12 in the very next video. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.